there. Let me see if I can get down there. I have no idea if this is a good idea or not. But there's only one way to find out. Ask somebody else. Huh. Right. Let's see if I can get down here. All these rocks that are potentially loose, I have to be careful so I don't cause an avalanche with me in the middle of it. Oh, wow. Yeah, I'm calling that a dead end. Obviously, it keeps going a bit, but that doesn't make it a good idea for me to go down there. Oh, wow. See? That's where I could have gone. There's obviously room down there, but you know what? I'm going to look for an easier way, and if there's no easier way, I'm just not going to try it. Oh, wow. Oops. Oh, wow. Okay, well. Down I go. Time to take off my backpack so I'll fit down here. Notice there's a way to the right. Whoops. Notice there's a way to the right first, but I'm gonna stay to the left to go uh, clockwise. So let me uh, do this. Trying to be gentle with my backpack. Oh wow. Oh wow, yeah. Huh. I'm glad I went down here. Uh, let me turn around. So yeah. Here's the way I came. Too easy. Alright. Oh, yeah, I remember this part. Wow. So check it out. This is the horizontal bridge. I go above or below. It's too hard to get on top. But, yeah, I can crawl below. No problem. Wow. But before I bother to do that. Wow. Can't remember if I've been up there or not. It might be easier to get up there from the other side. But anyway, see if I can get down here. Obviously, it's time for me to look at the formations over here along the wall. My goodness. So here's a big one right there. Look at the size of this one. This oops. This one's like a foot long. And yes, that's what she said. <laughs> okay, but seriously, it's rock. Notice how the, it's a different color. These dripstones are almost always gray, as opposed to brown, like the rest. I don't know why that is, actually. I'll have to ask somebody. It was funny, I was here last week with other people. Yeah, don't remember asking. Anyway, well, for most of the people, last week I went with it's our first time in this cave. Anyway. Wow. This is awesome. This cave is, just goes forever. Actually, it's not that long. It just seems long because it's so slow, because it's hard. Going to something like Ape Cave, you can walk the whole time, so you pretty much sprint through it. Here, you try to sprint through this sucker, you're gonna get yourself hurt, or worse, damage the cave. Here we go. Uh, wow. Wow. All right, well. I only have one more battery after this, so I think I might not be able to go through this cave twice today. Let's see how it goes. I 
I think I'm almost to the end anyway. Or at least the end of this tube. I'm not sure. Oh, we'll see how it goes. I had a map of this cave, but with these multiple levels and stuff, the map wasn't that helpful anyway. So, you know, if the map doesn't help me any, I just leave it at home. <laughs> What's the point? I would like to make a 3D model of these caves, but it's a lot of work the way I do it. Wow, this is getting to the good part. of the planet. Oops. Sorry, knocked a rock loose. Darn it, they made it do that. So, all right, so looks like there's nothing particularly interesting back here. Too small for people. So look at this, there's a big rock here. I can go above it or below it. Neither way is particularly interesting. I mean, particularly easy. Both ways are kind of interesting because they're pretty. I just want to be super careful so I don't get myself hurt or stuck. Oh, wow, here we go. Check this out. Look at all these little formations here. Full-fledged columns. They're all almost the exact same diameter. That's what's weird. It's like, how come they're always the same diameter? <laughs> 